Oh, oh, I'm not gonna pick. Right well, apparently, okay. Hey, everybody. Uh, live, live, uh, we are part. live from the Endo Grand Prix. As always, I am Dan Stratagli. I'm right now. We have uh, a few people here. Taco Bill Kafer has just entered onto the screen. Brat Mouse is here. Uh, Matt Thornton, Brendan. Uh, I don't know if you can't see him. But Derlin. Derlin. Brad Reinhold. Brad Reinhold is here. And uh, some giant guy in the background is trying also to give, here. Trying to give Ryan him a Whoa. So, uh, welcome to Hollow Theater. As always, like I said, I am live. Do you want the card? Yes. Yes. Uh, so, welcome to Hollow Theater, live Rainbow. from the Indoor Grand Prix. Exactly. As you can see, we have the <laughs> traditional Star Wars background for the feature table. Uh, Batmouse got in today. I got in today early as well. Uh, for those who are watching, the hotel is really nice. Really nice. Uh, the room is a little small. We're currently on Wi Fi. I'm really small, so that's okay. Yeah, Batmouse is really small. I'm really short, so it's. Uh, we got a lot of beverages of the alcoholic variant. Uh, worse, supply those. So We're stealing your beer, worse. Yeah. Uh, so, Batmouse, let's talk about the Indoor Grand Prix. Let's talk about the Indoor Grand Prix. So, you're coming off of a world's consolation victory where. You piloted your Maul Smashing Ship deck, your little, I'm going to start Maul with Slip Sliding Away, and uh, his location, you played the Cloud City West Gallery, and for Light Side, you played Quiet Mining Colony. I did. So, how do you... ...for this event? Oh, uh, I, I feel like there will be a lot of guys with lightsabers running around, which terrifies me. But reminds me of what the world's meta that I envisioned would be was that light side is going to have lightsabers. So you've got to deal with lightsabers. So maybe for your actual light side, you want to play a pivot deck and not be playing lightsabers because, you know. Lightsabers are bad. No, lightsabers are really good. That's the that's the point. The okay, lightsabers, so lightsabers are, are good. Lightsa lightsabers are good, but they're bad for the for the dark for the dark side. If you don't, even if you have the tricks, you have to have all of the tricks at the right time for it to matter so what kind of tricks are you talking about um so light side need you know a, as a light side player you're gonna have clash of sabers you're gonna have uh sorry about the mess you're gonna have you know multiple things to exclude uh you know land lando with uh viral axe excludes uh from battle and we've seen a plenty of uh, Lando with Vibro Axe in the, what was it, the Gem PC as well as the OCS Gem players PC, have OCS used him people. because he's a spy with uh, Qui-Gon communing. Right. And it, blo it it's a huge blowout when uh, somebody drops a Lando with Vibro Axe to an executor docking bay. Yeah, I know. Uh, B. Fred. B. Fred has some experience, but he walked he, off. He walked off. He, he heard us start talking about I know. About uh, that. We could talk to Mike Kessling. Away. Mike Kessling, did he have experience with that or no? I'm not sure. I didn't. But I know he's on the team with Brian he, he is. Do you have any experience with uh, with the Lando of Virax falling at the, what was it, Death Star document? The executor document. The, the, the executor document. Document. Or the Death Star. Any document bay. Any, any Lando of Virax experience at all? I do have Lando of Virax experience, but it's not a document. Come up here. Just just say a couple words. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. So we're talking about cards that in light side, the light side matter right now that... Uh, Lead to blowouts. To, yeah, lead, lead, lead to blowouts. I, we have beers on camera. Well. Yeah, I was going to say, my, uh, What's the my, question? So, what do you think about the meta for this Endo Grand Prix? I thought I was being asked about Lena with Vibro. Wait, wait, wait. He, he, he's well, in the meta. He's part of the card. <laughs> he's in the question. Okay. Uh, for Dark Side, I think there's a clear three or four best decks uh, CCT, Shadow Collective, ROPS, MAP. Oh, yeah. Bring him before me is probably a step below that, and then there's about four or five other dark side decks that are viable, but they're not as good as those best decks, which is very problematic for light side. So light side's best decks are old allies, some sort of commuting, either Qui Gon or uh, Yoda, Yoda, and then no idea QMC Profit. Those are all kind of QMC? Diplo. They're all fringe potential good. Why? Depending would, okay. May I interrupt you for one second? Why are you saying Profit when Profit is bad against Shadow Collective, something that you yourself are very familiar with? 
because it's good against some of the other dark side decks. Like, that's the problem for light side right now, is it's hard to have a light side that's well positioned against all of the dark side decks because the dark side decks attack from very different angles. So you can show up with a deck like Profit and maybe get good matchups and do really well, or you may have poor matchups and do very poorly, and it's not really a testament on necessarily how well you played or what. It's just a, a matchup issue. So what would you play? <laughs> That's a good question. What are you playing tomorrow, by the way? Come on, reveal these. Tomorrow. Okay, well, what are you playing for the team tournament? Are you playing in the team tournament? I don't know if I'm playing yet. I'm happy to play. We haven't we haven't made any formalized plans. So there's a bunch of us, depending on, how about this? By 5 o'clock, if I think I know my decks for Saturday, I'll probably play or be getting dinner. If I don't know my decks, I'll be getting DoorDash, and we'll be playing all night. Okay, so I have a question. Reveal these. Give us one card from your Saturday deck. Anger, fear, aggression, aggression. That's what I thought. <laughs> That's what I thought. I, I like the smart that you went with that instead of something like heading for the medical frigate. I want to eat hot. Well, this is the only card that I have Brian Fred's picture currently affixed to, so it's a hundred percent chance I'm playing with it on Saturday. Oh, hundred percent. Yeah. <laughs> no, for your dark side deck, well, uh, give us one card that you're playing. Knowledge and defense. Like wow. a true chance. So okay, so you're playing with that. Are you playing with? All I'm pretty sure I'll have a force push in my deck. Yeah, force push. Are you gonna have a walk league in your life deck? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Wait, that that that, that, that would be a good one. Yeah. I, I don't know. I, I don't know for so sure what I'm playing. playing he's not playing TRM. So okay. Uh, I had a question. Now I'm drawing a blank. <laughs> Wait, that happens a lot. Yeah, it does happen a lot. What defensive shields will I have under a set effect? Well, I'm assuming you're going to have them all. <laughs> oh, exactly. I, I'm, I'm here to answer your questions. Oh, well, Brian Fred uh, just okay. walked in. You can have an unlimited Tag amount you're of in. Brian Fred, sorry, you walked in. you got to give me on holiday. Tag you're in, buddy. For the, I think this is like We have a question for you. Where do I have to go? We have a question for you. Right here. Just right here. You can't even see me. I'm not crushing now. Yeah, we have a question for you. You have a question for me. I do. Um, do you have any experience with the Lando with Vibroax? That's the same No. No Lando with Vibroax for Docking Bay? No. I, th sure? I think I think you guys are probably saying the joke wrong. Yeah, and what, what, we were definitely what, saying the joke wrong. What, wasn't wasn't the joke supposed to be uh, something along the lines of somebody else getting beat down with Lando with Vibroax in the docking bay? Well, you brought this up. It, it was on one of your holiday table. Because I, I was the one that got I was the one that just got beat by a double Rebel Spy, not yeah. Lando with oh. Vibroax. And then somebody else, I guess Joe and. Uh, Silver Glen tied or something. They had to play a game, and, and then and then Joe, Silver dropped. Glenn, Joe got payback on Silver Glen yeah, for me. That yeah. is that, that, that's the one. But they, they they were definitely butchering that's that. That's the one. Yeah. Luckily, I Apparently. knew exactly what they were trying to say. Apparently, we butchered things. Well, he's the one. He's the one that, that broadcast it. I just happened to potentially watch it. So, Brian Fred, how are you doing? I'm good. How are you doing? How? Uh, when did you get in? Did you get in today? Yesterday? I got on Monday night. You got in. So why did you come in on Monday? Well, for the hangers. one, I always come like Tuesday to Monday so I can hang out with people. Nice. And this time, there was no direct flight uh, Tuesday. And I was like, you know what? I'll just come an extra day and come Monday to get a direct flight so I don't have to. Yeah, that, that was basically the selling point where I'm here an extra day that I'm usually. So what have you been doing since you got here Monday? Playing crap loads of board games. Which one playing? Oh, God. Trans Europa, Trans America. Uh, do that. Uh, what is it called? Uh, <laughs> Dune Imperium. I played that once. I saw that over there. It was pretty fun. I played Clank in Space. Okay. I played Cockroach Poker, which is amazing. Uh, plug in Cockroach Poker. And I played Port Royal. Port Royal is very you fun. What? I don't know. Port Royal. Know Port Royal is a is a pirate like resource building deck deck building game. That's a very oh, fun I, game. I bought it. Oh, we played Dead of Winter. Yeah. That yeah. one I do know. Yeah. I got a, a nice. It, it wasn't as bold. Like Brinson definitely screwed the pooch, but he had never played before. <laughs> That's what he does. And he was also the betrayer and had no idea what was going on. So That's what he does. First time, first time yeah. playing. So, let's talk about what you're feeling for like this weekend. So Friday night, are you playing in the team event? Yes, yeah, so I'll play the team event. Who is your partner? Steve Brinson, Psycho yeah. Steve, oldest, oldest living friend. Good reason to have it. Uh, Saturday, what are you playing? Mm, Virgin Communing? Really? Maybe. Which Reveal community? these. Huh? Which Communing? Do what? Which, com which Communing? Oh, uh, Qui-Gon. Qui-Gon or Yoda. 
Hell One of the two, not Obi Wan. That guy. So, why not Obi Wan? <laughs> yeah, that's not, not a good, uh, de- Definitely underpowered compared to the other two, probably. Brian, can you use Ray in Obi Wan version? That's probably the big selling point. No. If you can't no. use Ray, then no. Nah. That's can. probably so. It. Are you, you saying that? But you can use Ray in Obi Wan. Can't you only use Rebels with Obi Wan? No. No. So you can use Ray. No, you can't use. Uh, you can't use Jedi you can't, you, except for Yoda. No Jedi. Except okay. for Yoda. No Jedi and no maintenance costs. Well, probably just because Obi Wan's just bad then. <laughs> so, you said you're you're thinking about playing Verge. Yes. Why? What kind of Verge deck are you thinking? Like, uh, you're. Well, I'm not gonna tell you that part. <laughs> I, already, Wait, I already told you. There's what definitely I, gonna I be one that has Darth Vader in it. I already, told you, my, I already it. told you my objective. It's gonna definitely so gonna be Darth why Vader. Why Verge? I don't know. It's different. People have less information about what my is in my deck, which is an advantage. So besides your commuting, uh, so if you split, sit down and play against Shadow Collective or uh, CCT or Robster or something, I mean you're gonna know exactly within. We'll even say three three to five cards to five what cards. the other deck is going to be. You sit down and play against Verge, it's just like. You're going to know some cards that are in there, but you're not going to know within three to five cards of every list being the same. So, tell us one card you were playing in both of your decks. Revealsies. 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 Both of, oh, just like... Just, just yeah, a, a random card. Just right. a random card. Darth Vader. Which, v or non-V? Oh, do I have to tell you the persona? Yes. Yeah. Well, how about this? Grand Moff Tarkin. There you go. Okay. There's my Darth Vader card. V or non-V? Because okay. I don't... It is non-V. Ooh. That's, Canceling. That's interesting. Canceling. Woo. You gonna ask me what border it is? <laughs> yes. Well, obviously it's white. It is not. Silver. Oh. Silver. It's rainbow border. <laughs> both, <laughs> both, both of them. So if, if if you haven't seen Brian Fred's decks, they're probably the most decorated cards in the game. For good reason. Memories. Yeah. Yeah. It's the best part of the game. Do you stick? You still do you still sticker your decks? No, not since Justin Desai decided that it, it was cheating because I could scratch the sticker of my general beers and tell which card it was in the deck. And I was just like, I just have to take a lot of effort to like go through, you know, 60 cards and just do it to every single one as I'm shuffling. But that, that was him, and he made me one time change the general beers of a sticker out of my deck and play a different general beers. Well, I think you could still sticker anything that doesn't go into the deck. Can you? Oh, yeah. Like, my, my, there's a sticker on one of my objectives, but I mean, you know, not can't scratch that through the sleeve, I guess. <laughs> Sorry to sigh. So, so... <laughs> Best part of li- live Hollow Theater. Yep. Best part, Best of, live part of live Hollow Theater. Right here. Well, I mean, te- all Hollow Theaters are live. I mean, <laughs> okay, in person, in person now. Hollow Theater. Yeah, we actually have like a. We don't have anybody following on the street. Uh, sc- uh, yeah, because we're all here. They'll watch later. Yeah. yeah. I, I have a uh, something to admit though that to I still my deck that has general beers in it that I brought with me is the sticker general beers so if you if, if justin shows up he will have that information on me or my opponents can just be like hey i'm gonna dq i'm gonna get dq dq that time out actually i don't think is you that mean, in your hand i don't you think scratch uh, the sticker through the bottom so the rules are like the ai no i just played imperial any, uh, command non-real Come ais on. it's only the only issue you just have to have it on you, you have to have a spare copy command. yeah or and and for the most part, I don't think anybody would really say something. Well, you're like apparently. one of the nicest guys in Star Wars. Well, I mean, obviously, I'm not sticking cheating either with a one sticker general beers on my deck. I mean, you play Imperial Command, you can just pull them right. So it's just like. So is it a is your general veers white border or, or? He's black border. I'm black pretty border. sure. Yeah, he's black border. And he's it's, not Japanese, right? And it, it's just a big s- sticker that I put over his face. It just says Superstar with an exclamation point. But he didn't get. And you, wait, can you get an all-star sticker on that? Oh, I see what you did there. We'll ask Justin. Maybe he'll sign it for me then. Get an all-star sticker. That'll be that'll be good good times. I don't think Justin's watching, so. Oh I yeah, but he can watch the replay. He yeah. definitely can watch right. the replay now. Token yeah. storybook, superstar. <laughs> so, so how are like so? Again, I had a question, but now I can't think of it. I, I had a weird flight today. Well, that's the best part. Did you? I only got two hours of sleep last night. I heard, I heard you were cranky this morning. Oh, uh, yeah. he, He's always cranky. Yeah. Always so cranky. just take, the, take tonight, that one night, and just go to bed. I mean, I know you won't want to, but 
A little bit I early. Need, get yourself like 10 hours of sleep, yeah. and you'll just be recharged. He needs to lose to you in poker yeah, first. What do you, got, what do you, gotta do you need to lose, I'm not lose to me in poker. He needs to oh, lose we're going to stream poker tonight. Oh. We are going to stream poker over the, on over my the Twitch the channel. Sticker, the sticker token book, hashtag uh, screening poker tonight. Hey, hey, what's the buy-in for tonight? It'll be like $40 max, like 20 to 40 okay. It'll be like, uh, it's either 25 50 or $50. I think it's 25 50 Okay. And then you can rebuy, obviously, once you bust what? out. Cash game? It's a cash game. No. I don't think anybody wants to play. No. I mean, people are just more interested in cash games. Cash games. I, I would do both. I, 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 I would, would rather play tournament, tournament. too. So how many? Yeah, uh, we can just play like an eight-player tournament. I'd, I'd rather play tournament. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so how many people on your team are here? Uh, me and Kessling, uh, Bill and Sam. Four. I feel like I'm missing. Is that it? No, Jeremy, Apollo. Is he? Um, I think that's it. I so how many team members of uh, New Allies are here, Kessling? Is it? You have seven people. Who else? Seven. Who else? One, two, three, four. I counted five. the I counted the five of us. Not in this room at the tournament. Steve. Clayton. Steve who? Clayton's a new alley. Brenton. Did you so you guys Kessler was like, open, I don't know, I wanna hang out with them a little bit right? first. Or that was Charlie, wasn't it? That was that, that was Charlie. That was Charlie that was apprehensive. Charlie was like, I don't know, man. We want so many people on the team. I kinda wanna hang out with Look, them first. And I'm Clay, like, Clay <laughs> Yeah. Six. Seven, yeah. Six yeah. I mean, it's, it is new allies. We have to pick up somebody new at every event. <laughs> we're, like we're just so, yelling, and yelling hey, in the back. Can new allies? Um, and at, at, if we get Steve this event, it'll be ne next event. <laughs> next event, you show up. So, then, no, yeah. No, I think what we need to do You're is in the combine running. allies with Brian, Brian. Badass's team. Oh god. <laughs> oh yeah, he's he's already. Uh, uh, yeah, no, yeah. Team he's Killer B's like super as far yeah. as I'm concerned. What? Team Killer B, Dan Tartaglione just just tried to form an ally with new allies who's not even paying attention. I'm trying to. Yeah, I'm trying to like take down Team Five from this event. So Team Killer B is in new and and, and, and new LA joint joint forces to stop Team Five. If, if we did that, we would, would our, the team name be the Killer Allies. Yes. Yes. Killer that, that'd be pretty sick. Killer Allies. <laughs> yeah. We'll, we'll we'll work on it over dinner. Over dinner. Over poker. We'll, we'll see. Yeah. Over poker. That's over poker. What time is poker? I don't know. I kind of want to just like order food here so we don't have to leave. So we can just play poker and or board games or whatever we want to do. That's a good idea. And drink beers. So. And drink beers. Thank and you. Lemonades and everything. So. You need next? We call in. Am I tagging yeah, somebody in? Grab somebody in. Uh, Brad, you in? We're tagging yeah. Brad Reinhold in. Brad Reinhold. All, All right. right. That's a, actually, I have to tag. Yeah, yeah no, there's there, got to be a yeah. tag, yeah. Jeez, you guys didn't know. see the tag. There, there's a live they, tag. They, they did you see what tag. I bestowed him? Yes. Show that, was a, so, that was so, a hot tag. So, so, hot tag. didn't see this earlier, Brian Fred, is, like I said, he's one of the nicest guys in Star Wars, bestowed upon me a foil Darth Vader Emperor's Enforcer. Damn. The lesser Darth Vader, oh, but still a good one. And there's also... Yeah, he, has a, he has a personal Darth Vader. That's the he's best. making a joke. There's also a Max Rebo behind there. <laughs> I gave you that one out of my own personal collection of mine, not oh, the stash damn. I have to hand out for the PC. Well, he's going to steal from my hey, personal collection later uh, on. So. Once yeah, we're done with Hall of the Earth, uh, uh, buddy. I got to take you upstairs. Oh, whoa. Yeah, that's what he talks about. Well, that just happened. <laughs> I'm on Hollow Theater. Real, real All right. Intimate, hey, come on now. Come I, have I have something. I have some Somebody stuff is making Brian a deal. I have stuff, stuff for him. Brian Fred. <laughs> I bet you do. I bet you do. Okay, you Brad Reinhold is here. Brad Reinhold, yeah. Brad. That's literally a Team Killer Beast table right now because we've got... We got we've got Brenda Lynn sitting here. Yeah, we, we got, got Brenda you got Lynn over here sleeping sleeping cube cards. So so just multiple fair disclosure for everybody because we just had Brian Fred on. I'm only able card. to play in this tournament yeah. because of Brian Fred. Well, yeah, because Brian Fred hooked me up with all the cards I needed for my bets. So if you what are you playing? That, what am I playing? What cards. are you playing? I am playing Rops. And I am playing Yoda Community. Are you really? Yes, sir. 100%. 100%. Final answer. Final answer. That's bad, and you should feel bad. <laughs> no, it's not bad. I mean, those are gr those are both really good decks. Yeah. They're going to be really grindy games. Yes. And and, and you have a be, better chance of winning a grind for, game for than you do one, you will a play winning a beatdown. one-hour games. Each. Yes, sir. <clears throat> but you I'm can win one. to it. I came to play games. You can win one-hour games. It, it's those that, Go to you know, time each game. 
just win. Yeah. Yeah. You just need one more card in the right pile at the right time, folks. Yeah. yeah. So, you have been successful down in Florida. Uh, you won the uh, what? Dagobah. The Dagobah, Dagobah regionals, regionals over. Who was that Dagobah regionals? Uh, uh, literally, Kessling, Ryan, like Fred, all of New Bill, Allies. Taco Bell. Uh, Drew Lichtenstein. Drew Lichtenstein. So you basically took down all of Team New Allies. By myself, yes. That's By yourself. But That's... I had some help from them because they didn't do the things they should have done sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> wow. You're, you're so, saying they, he, they so beat what themselves. You're, what you're example, saying is... For example, I played Hunt Down against Taco Bell. Taco Bell was playing uh, Let the Wookiee Win Jedi Luke. Uh, he drops uh, Jedi Luke with lightsaber, Yoda, and Hera on Lone Vader, Lord of Everything, with lightsaber, fights. Uh, I clash Hera after missing Luke. Uh, I lose Vader and one. On my turn, I drop seven guys. Uh, That's a lot of guys. That's a lot of guys. Including Dr. Evazon and another say, Vader. And you dropped Maul. a lot of guys on, Bri- uh, on uh, Bill. That was a lot of, Bill. There was a lot of people on top of other the people. The key point to the story is Taco Bill saved no force. And I played first strike. And that was the end of the game. Hey, Bill. You Brad Reinhold. Is just, talking smack just, on you. He's talking smack on you. Yes, sir. This guy. I was just relating the story of our wonderful uh, Let the Wookiee Win game against Hunt Down at Regionals. Oh, Jesus. That's not a good game. Don't worry about that. Nobody cares about that. It sounds like it was a good game for someone it's fine. You, you won, and no one ever has to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> so, Bill. Except you right now. You're and now it's Chronicle. So, hold on. So, Bill is about to come on stream. Uh, Bill, you had a... Bring the other chair. <laughs> Bring the other chair. No, no. no. You get a four-person booth. Bill is kind of small. He can fit in the screen. So, you have had a quite a little bit of a month, the last two months on the OCS. Oh, Jesus, two chair. months. Bill is killing it right now. Oh. Isn't he like what? How everything in O? so well? I... I am 100% sure that I'm getting very lucky. Um, I should not be 23 and 1 or whatever I am. Uh, literally absurd for Taco Bell to be 23 and 1. But then you made the Gen PC top 8. I did. That's uh, completely... And you made the Jawa Cup top 8. Listen, don't worry about either of those. I got very lucky so several times. You're saying that you got lucky, but the facts are... You're winning. You're, you're doing well. Hey, uh, listen. Let's celebrate. So, though. in the Gen PC Top Eight, in the OCS, uh, I think Shadow Collective is a fantastic deck. I'm very happy to play it in all of those events. I will not lie to you. I'm going to play that on Saturday. Um, You're just getting all the Wow. Seats. Shadow Collective, very good. This is a very good episode. So, yeah, but yeah, Brian Fred said he's playing commuting and on the verge. Okay. Brad has said he's playing romps and commuting. All right. Yeah, you're saying you're playing Shadow Collective. What's and your life like? No uh, idea. Uh, no idea or legend. I'm between two decks. I'll tell you okay. right now. Those I played, are both very solid. So I played. Uh, I played no idea decks. in the not the February the March OCS. I played legend in the February OCS. Uh, both did very well for me. I think I went 6-0 and, and then 5-1. and one. Now, Bill, you tried something different this month. You tried to go away from mains for once. Tell us a little bit about that experience. I, so, I, for years, have thought I was a mains player. And then I have done very well with non-mains decks in uh, Shadow Collective and No Idea in the past two months. So, I, you tell me. Like, yeah, you're doing great. Is it, is it, am I a mains player? Am I a non-mains player? I don't know you're what I am Star anymore. Wars Maybe you're, you're a Star, Star Wars, Wars player. Maybe you're just a good player. Uh, I play Star Wars cards. That's what I do. Yes, sir. So, why is your hat, like, Oh, it's the City Connect. Apart? Oh, what are you going to... Oh, the day. City Connect. These are the the, uh, the cherry blossoms. Yeah. Early April oh. in Washington. Okay, they have the cherry that makes blossoms. sense. Very beautiful. Very so, beautiful. we have a question. Is Shadow Collective going to see a nerf after the event? Uh, I would not be surprised if Shadow Collective saw a nerf after the event. I would not be surprised. Uh, it has nothing to do with what it does at this event. I think at this point, both design and development are aware of the fact that Shadow Collective is a very powerful deck. Um, it is, I, I think it won 70% of games in February or something like that. Wow. Um, I've won with it. I don't know. Wow, that's the, the, testament the enough. But something that is testament enough. That is testament enough. I would not be surprised to see a nerf, but I would also not say, hey, there will be a nerf, right? That's a good. 
What would you do to the deck to bring it down a peg or two? Bring it down a peg or two? Uh, if you could eliminate the... the um, What's the the gig effect? Mind tricks will not work on me? Yeah. yeah. The gig effect? Uh, if you can eliminate that from being played by Shadow Collective, I think that would change how the deck is built. Um, I agree. I think it would. But wouldn't people just roll one more deck then? Well, I, you can run another gift. You can run something like Quietly Observing Virtual to, to uh, run like a Zyzer's Bounty, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, then you get Arica and, and Boba Fett, Angry Boba Fett. Right. Like, you get you get benefits from it, but you also lose the fact that you have to change the way how you play that deck, right? So, like, yeah. maybe I play the deck a little differently than everybody else, but I, I'm playing that deck as a control deck. So I'm putting a guy down, I'm putting three guys down across several sites to say, hey, come at me, bro. And you can't do anything because I... You can't beat me down because I have a gig effect, right? They'd have to beat you down twice in the same turn right. for it to matter, yeah. for it yeah. to really matter. Exactly. And when you have weapons that are forfeit value three, right? Like even somebody so like much. so, I, like I play chalk in the deck, and I, I think a lot of people don't play chalk. But like if you put oh. if you put chalk down, chalk is power four. Chalk is power plus three when you defend a battle. You have a, a gun that is forfeit three, so you're already at ten. Uh, chalk says you can't. Uh, reduce forfeit, value. forfeit values, right? So, like, he's forfeit value 3. You're already at 13, and Chalk doesn't even draw Destiny, and you're already at 13 before you can do any damage to Chalk. So, like, if I put Chalk down at the at the 2-1, at the defensive perimeter, what are you going to do? And then Chalk shoots it plus 2, plus whatever the One gun the does, site. plus whatever the site does. And so then like, plus Maul. Yeah, plus Maul. That's another plus 5. It's a plus Would 5 you, Do you think Maul is too powerful? I think Maul is what makes the deck tick. So, like, it's really up to design development if they want to, you know, change how the deck works. If they want to move uh, the deck from a Maul deck to another deck, another type of deck, right? Uh, Matt Thornton is raising his hand. What if Slip Sliding Away only deployed effects that are free? What if Slip Sliding Away... I, I hate that suggestion. Only we, we should not bring that up. Like, uh, <laughs> Jesus Christ, I can't talk. Only deployed <laughs> effects that are free. So yeah, I've been drinking since noon. But then you uh, get rid of my you get rid of my <laughs> droid racks too. Right. Yeah, but Listen. nobody pl nobody plays that crap. Well, apparently I did. So so you lose a gig, but you already play multiple masterful move because you're not a space tech. So I already played two masterful move combos, so I can pull my my gig effect pretty readily. Yeah. Uh, it would help. But I don't know that's going to be like a nail in a coffin. Like, it's not going to kill the deck, right? But it would also give him a, a starting slot. Uh, yeah, but my starting slot becomes... Quietly observing. I don't know, quietly observing, where yeah. I can play Watto you... and start the Watto site, or... <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Greedo? I could just deploy Greedo's react, or like you Boba? Play Greedo no, you can't. No, you ha he Boba. has to be quietly observing. Uh, yeah. Boba Fett Bounty Hunter, who... Doesn't yeah, add two or like Arca free Jesus. musician download. Yeah, or like Mara. Mara was saving a lightsaber, and you can yeah. play you were beaten. I don't know, it's questionable. So, again, let's go back to Maul. Do you you said he is he's the engine that makes the deck tick? Do you think the ability to add or subtract and say that your opponent can't cancel your destinies is too powerful on him? I leave that Maul alone. We're <laughs> Leave that ball alone. Brit, me, and I were in charge of uh, design and development. You would not be able to. Uh, I would. I would get rid of the text on Maul that says you can't cancel destiny. So like you have something like uh, Cassian who can cancel destinies. You have uh, what's what's the the Luke. So you have full WAP. You have you have WAP. You have the light side interrupt. You have what? You have wedge. You have their light side interrupt. Wedge is fine. Whatever. Um, the light side interrupt so, so that cancels a weapon destiny. I handle myself. You can't even do that, the cancel that, redraw. Is that thing? Yeah, anything cancel redraw. Redraw. yeah, and anything yeah. that cancel redraws so is kind of rough. You can't do right? so and Give I her like redraws. Like, right? Give her redraws. I feel like the mall was changed uh, in response to no idea, but now it doesn't right. even do anything against no idea. It just right. like co is completely yeah. different. So, I don't know. Give it redraws. It could be toned down a little. It could be toned yeah. down a little bit. I, I'm with Worfs on this. Chris Worf, Kelly, are you? Worf's if you're watching, who joined the. <laughs> he's not. Worfs who joined the broadcast just now. Hello. Uh, apparently, we want a 
show where people just talk Star Wars and have drinks. Oh. Hey, yeah, that's hey. a better hey. Hall of yeah. That's a better Hall of Fame. Hey. <laughs> so now we have Worf's on the, uh, he is it's the Worf's. Endor Grand Prix organizer. organizer. He brought us to this hotel. Uh, he supplied the backdrop for the feature table for Hall really of nice. Fantastic thing that I've seen yeah, for it's beautiful. two it's years. awesome. Yes. Yeah. Fantastic background. Yes. A little faded, but... No, listen. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you shut your mouth, Dan. Wow. Had to... <laughs> Jesus. Daniel's son. Any shot. <laughs> any, any shots he can take. Oh, this better. Dan trying to take shots. <laughs> I'll do shots. Uh, shots! <laughs> Well, he's already taking Brian Fred to a shot. room to show him something. <laughs> so, what do you play this weekend? How do you feel about the meta? Oh, uh, there's lots of great choices for Dark. Of course, I think I'm probably going to play like, CCT or or or, or, or Rops or. Uh, yeah, I would not be surprised if you play Rops. I know, I know. I, know. I have my own version of Rops. It's, it's a, I would love to it? see your version of Rops. Yeah. yeah. Um, You've seen it? No, but I've heard things. I've seen it. Yeah, it's you seen it. Yeah. I've heard things. Like We've seen it. Yeah. Uh, no, you haven't heard things. That's the whole point. I'll, I'll play Shadow Collective, so we'll see. Yeah. I have. Yeah, yeah. Shadow, I have a Shadow Collective book, too. That's it's awesome. lovely. It's very good. Great deck. Yeah. So, what do you think about for Light Side? Yeah. I'll, probably, yeah. I'll probably just play my Yoda Community, but. Yeah. I think a lot of people are going to play Yoda Community. Yeah. It's, it's, just, it's personal. It's two, just two it's, it's just good. You get space. Well, you get I'm ground. Doing two meters. Not all. Not all do it. No, no. Yeah. yeah. There's so, a good version that's on the ground. Yeah. The Endor version is uh, a, a really fun deck to play if you haven't played it. You you play like Camino and you play the two O from Camino and you play uh, a bunch of different. Not yet. Are you phrasing it the Endor version? Because we played it at Worlds. Well, uh, it's you it guys me, in Indoor. Yeah. It's you and Turner. Well, more than two. funny was that yours. Turner oh. and I and uh, we already said so. Another holiday table. Well, Turner and I and Harpster and Kyle. Colleen. That's pretty much all. We all played it. And we all went five and three, and Harpster went two and six. That's a very that's, Harpster thing that's to do. Very Harpster. Yeah. Harpster did it not have enough cake. It used to be the opposite. He would go five and three, and the rest of us would go two and six. Yeah. But so then he got a real job. Uh, <laughs> that sucks. I know. Lame. Yeah. And he's going to be showing up. I talked to him. And uh, he's been swamped at work. He got promoted again. What he is still he has to do the job that he's doing while finding his replacement. So, And it all happened like just recently. What is so, he doing for work? doing double work. He's like a high mucky muck in a construction. Oh, okay. Like, yeah. like he did this. He did the, the sales he built center. Things. Uh, the the new roof on the arena for the Kraken, and he did he does like convention centers. And I forgot there's stuff. a team named the Kraken up here. Yeah, it's amazing. They released the Kraken. They released the, the Kraken. Kraken, and they suck this year. They suck, they but their jerseys are nice. Their jerseys yes. are nice, yes. So, this is the what year for the Inter Grand Prix? I think it was. Uh, I think this is, we figured out it was the seventh. No, I'm, I don't, I'm I don't working on it right now. Right. And we're at a new venue for the first time. Normally, yes. it's been at the, the Hampton Inn. Uh, one, I guess the Hampton Inn. Same company. We can same company. Uh, for, for, for property. We're only about then boom, half a mile from the other one. So, yeah. But, yeah. So, a um, buddy of mine. But it looks, I think it's going to work out. So, printing of his own. How's yeah. the stream? How's the stream? Uh, how is okay. the stream quality, guys? Yeah. Like, uh, you guys are watching. We're on Wi Fi. We are on Wi Fi. We are ZX Halcyon. I don't know who that is. That's Zeke's. Zeke's, Zeke's Halcyon. You say good quality? Good nice. quality. Right. Good yeah. quality. Hey. Oh, That's good. Yeah, good quality is good. Yes. And uh, maybe we don't need a quality. nobody. Yeah. We'll see what happens. When You're we... somebody, apparently. You're the only person besides Chris Kelly actually cha uh, ta talking <laughs> in the chat. And Chris, Chris Kelly. Kelly only says one thing. Yeah, Chris Kelly. So Sunday morning, uh, for those who at 9 a.m., so right before the top eight starts, we're going to have a – College game day show with Chris Kelly to talk. 9 a.m. Eastern? 9 a.m. Pacific. 9 a.m. Pacific? Pacific. 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 So, noon so 6 a.m. Eastern. Noon Eastern. Oh, noon Eastern. That's yeah. right. Yeah, noon Eastern. Come on. Wait, are there going to be paper mache helmets? Just ignore me. No, but we're going to talk uh, spoilers. Oh. oh, spoilers. 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 For set 18 spoilers? Oh, boy. Be some Ooh, set 18 spoilers? What? Yeah. Yeah. Set 18 spoilers. Oh, boy. Yeah. That's important because, you know, the 30th, we have the, the one-day event. Yeah, the, the PC20 20. event is on the uh, 30th. I know Jared wants me to promote that down the tubes. Uh, I'll be we running also, at 7 a.m.? 
and be playing in the 3 p.m. I'll be streaming all day. I will be keeping other leagues away from interfering with anybody. Good and, job. Uh, Good job. Then the retro that started recently. That, have you, started have you guys been playing it? No, I, I played the retro. Red. I'm in the retro. I've been playing it. Uh, I am not in the I retro. I am oh and two with your light side. That's because you suck. Yeah, I lost a Timo. Well, okay, uh, that's team, fair. Timo is. is okay, so I have a posted is, is my fair. most updated list. That might be part of your problem. Uh, Timo beat me with TTO. Like how? What were you playing? Cards? Uh, no, combat. what were you playing? You were playing combat? Yeah. And you lost? Yeah. Team, with Shield Buster? Listen, yeah. Timo's going to crush Ow. the fucking... Uh, so, Timo, the, third the, turn, the, uh, got his system out. Yeah. And dropped the I've doubling effect. Yeah. And no escape. <laughs> so, you drained <laughs> Easter five on the ground. Yes. <laughs> Earlier than that. He was out damaging. And he was going to crush our and you have outer range. He, he had Sebulba's pod racer and beat me in the pod race. Okay, so boys and girls, play Senate. Play all Senate. Don't play anything but Senate. Please. That's, that's how you win the uh, yeah. Yeah. The so retro event. Ship me some Senate ability, decks ability, and I'll be fine. And I, I will ship disorder. you my update. Yeah. Non-virtual. And enter the bureaucrat. And, no, no. Don't even need. Don't even need. You just need civil disorders and ability. Civil ability. disorder, ability times three. Yep. That's it. Non-virtual. Yeah. Great cards. You just throw them down Good on luck. the table, and you just look at your opponent and Maybe say, what are you going to do? Maybe play a beggar. If you're playing Maybe light play side Senate, age. play stay here where it's safe. Yeah. Yeah. What? You can't play beggar online. Yes, you, yes can. you can. Yeah, they fixed it. They, they fixed fix it. it. <laughs> oh, God. Worse is yeah. <laughs> Wait, oh, has Frozen Assets shown up yet? No. 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 All right. uh, I have a Pittsburgh event. They're like The Pittsburgh doing, I was doing a Jeff event with all the Jedi. So I want your guys' help. We've taken down Jedi. some appointment. Uh, I, want, I want you guys to look at my decks and make sure they're, they're terrible. Yeah, they're already bad. Well, 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 okay, so it's the a, first it's thing you have to do is right? you have to practice. That's your number one problem. I'm two and one. Practice, practice, practice. Practice, practice, practice. Also, how many games ability, do you play a ability, month? ability, yeah. ability. How many games do you play a month? Five. <laughs> That's not Unless there's an OCS, then happen. I play 12. Do you need, okay. In an OCS five, month, you, you should be playing at least 23 games a month. At least. I play more Magic on Arena. I play That's why you way more magic than you. I'm reasonably certain. I also play live events on... Uh, I don't play any magic live and events. And I play modern. The uh, secret forbidden listen, format. If you want to be good at Star Wars cards, you need to be playing... So if you want to be good at OCS, right? 12 yes. games a month. You need to be playing... 20... What's what's 20, 26 plus... Bill, I, I play like... 32 games a month. Bill? At least. But you're not good at the OCS. I'm not good at the OCS, but I play like 100 games a month. What, what's my problem? You need to play better cards. Yes, sir. <laughs> so, uh, what is the solution for competitive? Is that competitive balance, or what do you mean by CB? Uh, each person uh, tops uh, each person's opinion of the top meta deck for Light Side and Dark Side. Shadow Collective, Rops, CCT, bring it before me. Matt, like Kessling well, said, Matt. Q Q yeah, QMC Matt showed up. Q QMC showed up. Too. You want top 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 decks right now? Yeah, I showed you. Shadow Club. Shadow Club. I did. did you uh, Shadow Club. Yeah, yeah, Rops well, is the, one two. The secret forbidden format. And then we'll talk about uh, more later. Uh, for light side? Oh, dark side. Dark side. Dark side. Dark side. Shadow Club. Yeah. Rops. Right. We're only two. Yeah. yeah. Those are the two. For yeah. light side, what do you think? That's tough. No idea, legend, commuting. They Some all, combination have, of the three. Yeah, there's, there's two. The top two of those are commuting. Decks. I'm gonna play no idea and legend. Those are my top two. And uh, feel free to I tell me I'm wrong. I, I, I don't I, think you're wrong. I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't I was gonna say I've got Yoda commuting and no idea with me. <laughs> yeah. And old allies just because I played oh, it at a SoCal event and I'm too lazy to build another deck. Old allies is pretty good. I think it loses the Shadow Club. SSA v Walkers. What do you guys think about the Walker deck? The Walkers is fun. Yeah, it's, it's not. It's not. It's, it's not, not good not enough. It's not super serious. Yeah, it's fragile. It's the Walker deck is very fragile. If you lose, you lose mains, too many force yeah. early, and it's over. If you want to not beat mains, maybe as long as you don't have Walkers. Walkers. I don't know. <laughs> and then, <laughs> what's your solution for competitive balance? Because I know you're on that committee. I I have just been joined to the competitive competitive balance team. Uh, I looked at some of the threads. I think you will see a change to uh, Shadow Collective very soon. Um, I think you will see a change to 
Um, I can't give too much away. It's give us one more. Mm -hmm. one more. What about, uh, do you think, think we'll see a change to ROPS? ROPS is definitely on the radar. I don't know that we'll see a change to ROPS immediately. I think it's more of a, uh, uh, not, so, not necessarily a change to ROPS, but maybe you get a card instead of a team that has some kind of ROPS, an anti-ROPS okay. feel. A little hate? A yeah. little hate? Like, like something to affect the, the loss pile? Uh, that is, that would be a good way to attack ROPS, right? To, yeah, could, to, take, to, take away their, their weapons. To attach the fact that they can, you know, uh, exchange any card. Maybe yeah. we restrict that to not any card, or maybe we restrict a way to... Um, take a specific card back. W would another option be to make a light side card that specifically targeted the lost pile? I, I could see that. I could certainly see that. Oh, God, we have too many shields. We could have an unlimited amount. You could have an unlimited amount. Like free ride combo was the thing that came out. Yeah. Yeah. I don't I don't know that, that Dark Side is that bad. I think the meta is adjusting. We're building our decks to beat them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I don't... I, I think... Yeah. I think the jury's still out. The top uh, players. Yeah, and I have faith in D&D &D to say, like, okay, they yeah. they realize that maybe ROPS swapping right. is a problem, or they see that a right. uh, Shadow Collective is a problem. Maybe they release some counters to those decks, right? right? So right. if you were Chris Kelly and you could design any card you wanted, what would it be? Gotta be a sock puppet. Jesus. <laughs> if I was Chris Kelly. <laughs> well, first of all, you'd be a Yankee fan. Jesus, if you were to take his hat off. Hold on. <laughs> 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 Go like this, Bill. Like this. Like this. You got it. You got it. You got it. Sit there like this. <laughs> if I was Chris Kelly, <laughs> <laughs> he's in the shed. Uh, wait, wait. If Brian Fred had a good new car we were talking Chris about, Kelly. but we're kind of keeping it under wraps. Um, I should let Brian tell the story. Brian, oh God, Brian, hey, Brian. Oh God. are you ready to to, 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 are you ready to break the the Harat deck yet? Oh man, you want to come and tell him? You, come on, you better tell him the Harat. Yeah. No, you come. <laughs> come on, come on. Oh, story time. We okay, we have a Brian now. Fred story time now. Yeah. This just happened over the last few days. Oh God. Oh God. <laughs> All right, so worse lives. Uh, Next to this uh, famous uh, high school, high school, junior high. <laughs> it's not famous. <laughs> okay, uh, middle school. It's a okay, there's a middle school, and we're like, we drive by it like, at least the first time I noticed, and I'm just like, oh hey, Sacagawea, and <laughs> and worse is just like it's Sacagawea, and I'm just like, play all right, worse. I'm pretty sure I know what Sacagawea is. I'm pretty sure it's when you have Harat down, and somebody plays like Speak with the Jedi Council, and you just sense, and your opponent's like, um, okay. And then you just draw a Premier Jaw one. It's a one, so you sense it with Harat, and you're just like blowing out for the turn. <laughs> So that's me and worse. So, so then, and then I don't know. I don't know who. I don't know who worse and I pick up the next day. I think it's yeah. who do we, it, it wasn't you the very next on Tuesday we picked up. Oh, yeah, we picked. Well, okay, we picked. A, well, whenever well, we drove we by, it was Sean Ball. Then we got Brad. Yeah, it was Brad. So yeah. So I think we when we drove to get Kessling, maybe. Yeah. We went by it again with a different person in the car. I was like, oh, hey, Sakajawa. And the person sees <laughs> it. Was like, hey, was it goes, yeah, goes, this happened three goes, times. It's not Sakajawa. It, it's like, I'm pretty sure it's Sakajawa. I was just like, I was like, okay, detective. And I was like, don't you know what, what Sakajawa is? It's when you have Harat on the table, and your opponent plays some interrupt, plays speak with the Jedi Council, and you play Sense, and they're like, sure? And they just draw a premier job on the Destiny 1 and Sense it, and they're just blowing out. And I, this was the third time, because the third time is when Ken, Ken no, okay, it was the, the three of us in Brinson? Yeah. Yeah, then the third Great time we drive by it, I'm just like, oh, Sacagawa. And this time, Brinson's like, it's Sacagawea. And I'm just like, I'm just like, no, Steve. It's clearly Sacagawa. I've told these guys, it's when you have Harat down, and they play some interrupt, and you sense it, and they draw a Jawa for Destiny. And they're just like, what the then fuck? Then we have to start looking up the card. And then Mike's like, hold on. He's like, what does Harat do? And I'm just like... I was like, I don't know. I was like, he might be one of those three ability Jawas. I think it's like Witten and Kalit or three ability. And, but he's so like, he, the text that he gives us control. And I didn't know. I didn't remember any of the text. I'm just like, I even spelled it wrong. And he's like, oh, it's not Herat. It's Herit. It has an A in it. I'm just like, oh, okay. And he reads. He's like, oh, he's three ability. And he's like, oh shit. 
He's like, if you have an Utini and three Jawas on the table, you can play Utini to do some. I can't remember all of it. Cancel, cancel, cancel. Control. Well, cancel something or cancel control. Right. It's like, holy Force shit. Training. Force training. So, so when you play sense, they try and play alter to cancel your sense with Harat. You just play a new Teeny and cancel her control. <laughs> and then you draw a Jawa for Destiny and sense it. And it's just like, how many cards mm. are we going to lose this turn to Harat? <laughs> So that's the story of Sakajawa. <laughs> there you have it, folks. Set it to spoilers. <laughs> I think we're going to end on that, that note. That's your spoilers for the day. <laughs> and, and with that, Sakajawa is your, is your token. Sac yeah, Sakajawa is the token. Don't be surprised if I use my main card B design on Harat and make him a Jedi. <laughs> Jedi Jawa that does something. <laughs> <laughs> and on that note, everybody, good night uh, against Friday. Uh, tomorrow is the team tournament. Uh, Poker tonight on your channel. Saturday is the main event at 10 a.m. Pacific time. Pacific. Uh, top 8, 10 a.m. Sunday Pacific. Uh, 9 a.m. is the game day show. And if you want to watch poker tonight, uh, I'm, it's going to be on my channel tonight. Uh, we'll be playing poker, and uh, it's going to be fun. Tell them the token, Bill. Tell them the token, Bill. Oh, what's the token? The token is obviously Harat. No, no, it's Sakajawa. <laughs> what? It's Harat. <laughs> the token's Harat. No, there's an A in it, remember? Harat. It's <laughs> an A. Harat. <laughs> Good night, everybody. <laughs>